In this video, I'm going to show you how you can upload your uh, mock papers or your past papers to the uh, section in Firefly. So once you've logged into Firefly, and if you're not sure how to do that, then see the video called How to Log Into Firefly. You want to come to the Resources section at the top. You want to click on Senior, and you'll see there is a section called Past Papers. Once you go in there, you should see above me here that you've got sections for A-Level and GCSE. And whichever one you go into, you should see a list of all of the subjects there. The, the list will be down the side, and it will also be um, in the center here. So being a politics teacher, I am gonna go into the politics section of my A-Level. Now, if you wished to, you could create sub-pages here for different units or different um, parts of your course, um, but I'm just going to put a load of papers into this page that students can get to. So I'm going to click edit page, which is down the bottom right hand side. If this button isn't here um, for any reason, then um, speak to me, um, but it should be there because you're a teacher, so you have permission to edit these things. So you click edit page and you'll notice that the whole kind of page around the outside um, grays out and you can now kind of type in. So what you could do is you could, uh, so in politics I've got three different types of papers, so I could um, put something like paper one in kind of text and I could put several paper ones in there and then paper two and put several things beneath, beneath that. I could maybe make it look a little prettier um, and then stick paper ones beneath that. Or you can just do it, what I'm going to do here, and just stick a load of documents in there. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to a folder where I have um, got lots of my uh, previous politics papers. You can do it one at a time, and I'll show you what happens if you do. So I'm just going to drag this one um, into um, uh, Firefly there. Um, I could also get do the same thing by going up to this button here, which says uh, File, and I can find the file uh, in my computer. That would also work as well. And you can see if I do that, the paper then appears there. And uh, once I click Done, the students will be able to scroll up and down um, in that paper, which works, uh, which works very, very nicely. And the students can also download that paper by um, clicking on uh, that little bit at the bottom there. But if you want to do it, if you want to put a lot of things up, there's another way that you can actually do it on mass. So if you click edit page again, uh, I'm just going to delete the one that I put there already. Uh, I'm going to go back to the, the folder and this time I'm going to drag, I'm going to select the whole lot um, that I want to put in there. So um, a, a bunch of sample papers and now I'm just going to drag the whole lot together. And if you haven't seen done that before, if you select everything and then just click on one of them, the whole lot will come with you. You click that and uh, so you release the mouse as you uh, get into that section there. So, I, so I, I held down the mouse, pulled over, released the mouse, and you can see the whole lot there has appeared. Paper one, paper two, and sample papers there. Very nice, quick and easy. Um, click done, and the students can just go in and do any of the ones that they like. There are more, you can make it look prettier, there are other ways of doing it, um, but if you just want to quick and easily upload a bunch of um, papers to Firefly, and that's how you do it. Hope that was useful. Thanks very much.